Alright, hey guys, this is Endless, and I am playing a replay here that uh, Killer B sent me, actually. Um, now, if you guys don't know Killer B, he's a guy on the Island Defense forums, and uh, he's from EU, actually, Europe. So, um, I imagine that you, I thought you guys might be interested, he thought you guys might, might be interested in seeing uh, some of the Europe games and what I iteration they're on. They're actually, I think, a update behind us. I'm not sure. Not really. Yeah, I think so. Yes, they are. They are actually an update behind us. If you look at the Thor's abilities, it doesn't have any of the new ones. So anyway, I'm going to unpause the game here, and uh, let's just see it as it goes. I haven't watched this game yet, so, uh, whoa, okay, one moment. Let me turn down my sound. Oh, boy. Uh... Well, I thought it had had it lower than that, but okay. Anyway, so here we go. So um, the Titan is I T O, but yeah, I haven't watched this game before, so I don't really know how it's gonna go. Um, so let's just watch it and see what happens. Uh, let's see, what is everybody? So Das Origami as uh, D T, John as uh. Bane Lane, what do we got? A Infester Titan. Well, Parasite and Saturate. Interesting. Okay. So it is still the old edition. Yeah, he even gets nine from the random gold. Andrus as a zealot. Lost Chaos as a zealot. Interesting place to choose to wood. Um, Killer B as Spectre. Uh, Yaluzan as Bane Lane. Burrowed Infester, just like wandering around. I have no clue what he's doing why is he burrowed okay uh tip to ito if you ever should happen to watch this uh don't move around burrowed like seriously it's a really bad idea um so it's it's just like not something's hard to do you're so much slower while you're burrowed you won't get anywhere like at all i mean i like that you took one level burrow one level nuke that's not bad i guess I would have taken one level Nidus, one level Burrow. Um, maybe one level Nidus, one level Nuke, because Nidus is legitimately the ultimate chasing strategy, as someone's like running through an area, you just plop down a Nidus on uh, wherever they are, and they can't walk through it, so that's pretty awesome. Also, um, another thing that the Titan's doing is he's checking... I mean, he's checking bases, but these are not traditional wood bases. Like, this, this is a much better place to check, where he's heading now. This is a common wood base. Up here is a common wood base. Um, this is... I don't think I've ever seen any one wood base there. And he's not killing... Uh, this, uh, he's not killing the... What's it called? The Zealot. There we go. That's what I was looking for. That's good. So he's not killing the Zealot. That's actually really, really good for the Titan. That's quite smart. Because if the Zealot is bad enough to let himself get caught once, uh, he's probably going to feed again. Um, so by this point... A lot of the builders have a reasonable amount of gold. The DTs have been golding like crazy. Um, I don't think anyone else has actually been golding a lot. So uh, Killer B is doing this thing where he's, with his Spectre where he uh, stacks up trucks around it. I kind of have always liked this strategy. I think it's a pretty good one. But um, I think it can lead to some very easy defense. Uh, stalls the Titan a little bit. And again, the Burrow. You're not going to catch him, man. You're just not going to catch him. So, if you see a Titan burrow like this, or if even if you don't, like if a Titan has burrow like this, you shouldn't be using it to just chase around builders, because that's not going to work. It's just blatantly not going to work. Uh, and you can't, you can't go through there, dude. Oh, oh, he should have unburrowed there. If he had unburrowed there, that would have been fantastic. I think the Baneling was, mm, yep, okay, the Baneling got away, thankfully. But, um... The bailing get away? Yeah, the bailing got away. His stuff didn't disappear. Um, so interesting here. Um, yeah, nothing really going on. Uh, I don't know how I feel about wooding here. Honestly, not a lot of space. Not a lot getting done. I mean, look at this. You got like three guys all the way out here. You got these little guys that are going all the way over here. You got this guy all the way over here. I mean, it's a good wood base overall, but then again, the Titan can also just come up here and, whoa, epic looking you. 
But anyway, the Titan, you can just come up here, scan, and then nuke, and then that's a ridiculous amount of feed you just gave him. So, um, I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. I mean, this is, this is a pretty boring game so far. So, um, this is a pretty good wood base, but why only one? Like, actually though and then this doesn't block it off entirely okay this is this is kind of a noob game here uh titan isn't great little he's he's not god awful but he's he's a little slow to pick up on what he's supposed to do here um not a great scan location generally as titan the places to scan are around here around here around here or so and like i think here is usually a pretty good one. This will pick up there, there, and there, as well as anything up here. Um, so, what is this? Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, boy, if the Titan finds that, that's going to be a lot of feed. Like, a lot of feed. Alright, so I don't know what exactly ITO is doing at this. Oh, he scanned it. Perfect. So, uh... Yeah. So, I don't think this guy entirely gets what's up with his walls. Uh, nope. He's just gonna put another one out there. <laughs> this child is a genius. Um, and at the same time, the Titan's just getting closer and closer. Uh, and now there's no walls! And the Titan is just going to burrow his way in. No! Yeah! No, he's not! The Titan's going to get really close, and then burrow his way in, and then just, like, walk in, and that's... Oh, boy, and now Dragon Force is raging, and Killer B is the voice of reason. Good for him, good for him. I try to be the voice of reason, but a lot of rage in this game. Uh, at least he did debt. I mean, that's actually a very good point. The Titan's level 4 currently, which is not the end of the world. Level 4 is very, very, very easy to deal with. Um, if he were, like, level 6 after this, that would kind of be a problem. But, oh well. Uh, looks like someone took over someone else, but I don't know who. Uh, someone named Dragon Force apparently took over the guy who left. Um, anyway, so we got this guy running off again. So now here's, here's something that you kind of should know if you're playing as a noob. Do not... If your wood base gets destroyed once, and it's pretty obvious that it's going to happen again, don't go and wood base immediately again. I mean, it's just not going to work. You're just going to have the same result. Um, tip for Lost Chaos. You are actually pretty good here, but not a great wood spot. I would suggest, like, uh, not there. Um, I don't know. Yeah, again, here, here. This is an alright place, I guess, if you wall it well. Down here is awesome. In here is an alright wood spot as well. Uh, here, if you wall well, here is fantastic. This is one of my favorites. Um, and all along here, I guess, is pretty good. Um, those are generally my favorite wood spots. There's a lot of other places, but that's gen those are generally my favorite. Um, looks like Titan nukes something. It's level 5 now. Level 5 is when Titans start to get, generally start to get a little more dangerous. Um, but not a lot going on. Andrus is basing again. Uh, this is another thing that noobs don't seem to understand, is that you don't base until you have the money for it, because the Titan gets more powerful as you give him, as he kills stuff. It's called feed. So if you build before you have the money, you'll just end up feeding, because the Titan will be able to break it, and he'll be able to get the feed and it'll just waste money for you and give experience to the Titan. And that's, well, that's obviously bad. Ooh, that was a pretty good juke by Das Origami. Um, kind of badly placed. Um, claiming that you can't kill him. He's probably right. That's a DT with 700 HP. Um, it's probably not going to die. Yeah, but you can't go either. Um... Yeah, he has I. Uh, so he really can't gold, but that's very, very temporary. So this guy just looks like he's planning on camping or something. I don't even know. I mean, uh, so not even a base up yet beyond this one. 
Not a great game. Pretty slow so far. So I'm just going to speed this whole process up and just fast forward times four. And just sit here and watch. And talk. And talk. And continue to talk. Still talking. I don't know. He's just waiting till I has passed. Da 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 da. Da da da. <laughs> Denying bane lean structures using roaches. Because that's totally how it works. Um, that bane lean is not dead. That bane lean actually died. Wow. Who was that? Oh, Dragon Force died. Oh, that's too bad. Alright. Anyway, uh, looks like someone is attempting to kick someone else. Okay, this is a, uh, interesting base. Not how I would have walled it, but, um, oh, someone else died. Fascinating. Uh, who died that time? Oh! Uh, looks like the purple DT died. Interesting. So, um... Yeah, interesting. Uh, this base is not looking particularly great. Uh, that's a dead stalker. Oh boy, that's oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. If they had just kicked him, if they had just kicked him. Oh no, 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 no. Just kick him. Just, just kick. Oh, marauders. Oh, marauders. Marauders are known for not being able to do jack shit. Um, marauders have a lot of health, but don't exactly do much beyond that. They're like living walls. Um, so this is an interesting sort of stalemate situation. Uh, he can't exactly do anything, but yeah, okay, now, now everything's dead. Yeah, that's why Burrow is good. Um, interesting that he chose to use the HP potion while Burrow. That's actually pretty, that's actually a pretty good idea. Um, a lot of people don't realize that with Chon and with Infestor, you can use HP potions while you're burrowed, which is a lot of HP healed really quickly. Oh, there goes another death. And, okay, I had no idea that this was going to turn out this way. So, continuing to just speed things along, AFO Motero. Um, this is not, not what I'd call a base. This is, this is what, this is what I would not, no, this is just, no, 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 okay, anyway, so it looks like they're finally trying to kick Andrus, um, no, maybe they're not trying to kick Andrus, I have no idea who they're trying to kick, uh, anyway, so, um, looks like Lost Chaos has gotten up an actual base, now this is, this is a, this is a, better base I don't like the walls I sincerely sincerely dislike the walls I I feel that like yeah the Titan is oh hey he has gold um I feel like yeah I guess against a, a, uh, I don't know how I feel about this um yes it means you can fit in more cannons for more DPS and the main DPS will hit right about here but then you only have three walls left I mean, it's a lot of DPS, but you have really one wall before he hits cannons. So I'm kind of iffy on this. I think it's I think it'll work, um, but I don't know. I mean, where is the main DPS on this? Oh, wow! Never mind. I guess the main source of DPS is right about here. Maybe even yeah. Actually, I guess it really does hit like around here or here. Huh. Live you learn. Oh, he nuked the mines. That's actually a lot of feed. Mines can provide a lot of feed if you don't debt them properly. Um, so it looks like uh, Killer B is planning on stacking up rotters there to try and trap them. And oh my god, Baneling. Wow. Uh, there goes the Immortal Mini. This was before the push priority update. Oh, no. Looks like it's not going to get... Oh, they got him. So... Uh, oh, DT almost... Okay, now to slow things down, because now things are actually happening. So, uh, Lost Chaos has very little money left, and does not have much in the way of walls. Uh, I think he's okay, because the Titan 
hasn't proved himself to be the best so far, especially when you consider 115 gold stacked up. Like, okay, spend your gold, kid. Come on, spend it. There you go. What did you just buy? What are you buying? You're buying attack upgrades. Okay. And is that it? Are you done? More attack upgrades. And a life upgrade. And another attack upgrade. And another life upgrade. And you get another life upgrade. You want another life upgrade? I think you want another life upgrade. Um, but anyway, so... I don't know why he's doing this, but uh, he still has an unhatched mini. He's scanning around the map. I mean, he's not in a bad position, but... 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 Okay, interesting. Um, I don't think I've ever seen a base like this. Oh, in all honesty, I on I will not lie. I've never seen a base like this before. Uh, I can't say that it's a particularly good base. I sincerely don't think it is. I sincerely think that they're uh kind of screwed. The tide never figures out how to get up the ramp because he can just burrow. Up. He killed the medic. Now he can burrow. Uh oh. Okay, that's a lot of damage, and the DC almost died. And the Titan's almost dead. The Titan is officially dead. Oh, nope. He's going to teleport back, and he makes it. Oh, man. That was actually kind of nice. That was a pretty clutch teleport. Um, Looks like he actually has Nidus now. Is it on cooldown? Yeah, it's on cooldown. He hasn't really been making use of Nidus, which is too bad, because Nidus is a really good ability, both for chasing and for just general awesomeness. Um, I don't know what this guy is doing, but he hasn't rewalled. He hasn't built any more towers. He hasn't built any more supply. He's not destroying his stuff. He's There's a whole endless list of stuff that is wrong with this picture that I could do. But um, Andrus looks like he actually has a uh actually has a base up. Um, it's not a great base. It's kind of a crappy base. Again, walled incorrectly. One line of walls is not going to do it, like, ever. Um, oh, and looks like the Titan got in. Probably just burrowed in. Um, how much gold does this guy have? He has 51 gold. Any person with 51 gold who knew what they were doing would have won this as a Reaper by now. So the Titan is officially level 9. Which is kind of a problem. Um, this guy has gold. I don't... He hasn't really been re-walling much. He only has a couple of transcendentals, which is what he appears to be focusing on. He really kind of needs more walls, though. I mean, um... Yeah, I suppose it's perfectly fine to critique, but... Main DPS of his is right around here. Yeah, it's right around there. These two walls, this area would be the main DPS. So if he could get, like, a single wall right there, that'd be kind of ideal. Uh, let me see, what does he got? So he's going for Heavy Vulture. Um, this was when Vultures could stack a ridiculous amount of mines instantly. And that was truly obnoxious for any Titan that n knew or didn't know what the hell they were doing. Uh, it looks like the Titan is going to find this base and just win. I mean, just, like, blatantly win. He's not going to move his probes, is he? He didn't move his probes. Oh, now he moved his probes, but the Titan's already left. Where is the Titan? I have no idea. There he is. Okay. So the Titan's going after this one Stargate when he could have nuked every single one of those workers. That's totally, totally brilliant right there. Yeah, um, that's a totally good idea. But anyway, so... Looks like the Titan stacked damage... So he's now just going to, like, freely walk into this base and murder everything brutally. It's kind of GG. I don't see... Oh, oh! Oh. 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 Uh, so can someone else tell me what just happened? Because I'm a little confused myself. I mean, I didn't expect the Titan to die. I know I said it's kind of GG, but that's because I'm really pessimistic. Um, and this guy did not have that many Transcendental Photon Cannons. He could have gotten another, actually, but that's a tangent. So, um, DT's OP, apparently. DT's totally OP. Yeah, because it's totally not a useless builder and is completely OP. Anyway, um, that's a DT with 72 gold. Why does that thing have 72 gold? Anyway, so, um, 
All right, I hope you guys like this video. I'm going to sign out now before I continue rambling, and I'll see you all soon.